Welcome back. Stasa23 here, back again with some knife therapy. And I want to first off say, hope everybody had a great holiday. And um, I really hope everybody has a great new year. I want to also say that I'm, I'm sorry that the contest has been delayed so much. Uh, the holidays, it were completely uh, chaos. And I got super busy. And then right after the holidays, me and my daughter said we're going to get it done, but she came down with the flu. She's got the flu along with everybody else in my house besides me. Hopefully, knock on wood, I won't get it. But uh, my daughter's going to be the one picking the winners to the giveaway. So y'all please bear with me. As soon as she feels up to it, we're going to do the video together. And I just want to say thank you to everybody who entered. Got a lot of awesome comments, a lot of awesome questions for the Q&A. And uh, I'm currently working on the question and answer video, um, you know, that should be coming up sooner. It'll probably be a two or three part video because there's way too many questions to answer in the in one video. Also, some stuff that we got coming up on the channel. Um, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do semi-reviews on four knives I got for Christmas. The first one you see right here. Got this one from a family member who knew I love knives, and just a cool little knife. Not something I would have bought by you know myself, but it's cool. This is the Remington Black Label 1911 folder, and it's called the 1911 folder because it has a 1911 style grip. And Remington, being a gun company, you know goes well. Uh, something cool about this folder. And it has something that I don't know if it's licensed or not, so, you know, it was a gift. Um, see the flipper tab right there, and it has good action on it. And as you see, the flipper tab is not there. And I didn't notice this until after, after I flipped it like this, I flipped it like that, and I noticed the flipper tab was up there, and I was like, what in the heck? I was like, that's going to be odd to... And I noticed you can push it down. So it's kind of got like that kick stop or whatever it's called. I don't know if it's done the same way. But, um, and like I said, I don't know if it's licensed, but that's a feature. We'll talk about it in the full review. That's the first one that I got. Uh, next one got from, uh, I think my aunt gave this to me. It's uh, Outdoor Edge. I had seen this one. I was going to pick it up anyway just because it was like, I think, a $20 knife um, made by Outdoor Edge, as you can see right, well, you have to, yeah, there you go, Outdoor Edge. Got like this rubber polymer handle, back lock, uh, Tanto style blade. Uh, it's the 3.3 Chasm. I don't know. I'm probably butchering that name. Uh, I think it's 420HC steel. Uh, pretty cool little folder for 20 bucks. I'll be testing and reviewing that one. And uh, after I show you all, y'all let me know which one y'all want to see first, and we'll get that one out. The next one, a friend of mine that I used to work with, he saw that I had a knife in this brand, so he picked me this up, and I was, I'm pretty happy with it. It's pretty cool. It's the CH3004. It's got carbon fiber, very nice carbon fiber. It's like a satin carbon fiber. And you got Aussate blade steel, which I tested this CH, oh, CH35, uh, I think it's 3504 in Aussate. And this was very, very good Aussate, I will say that. So, um, and being a gift, you know, definitely love getting knives as gifts. Um, got a titanium pivot collar. It's a titanium frame lock that's been coated with black, and it's got some gold anodizing with a mill titanium pocket clip. This one's on bearing, super smooth, drops free, and rockets out. Like I said, y'all let me know what y'all want to do a review on. And this was a uh, stocking stuffer from my wife. And I'm going to tell you right now, it's a beater knife, but I was super shocked of how nice it was for $4. Got the Ozark Trail knife. I'm going to call it the green and black knife. 
like I said, you know, everybody knows about these. This is a $4 knife. And look how smooth this, this guy is super smooth. And I used it to cut open a lot of clamshell packages and stuff for uh, Christmas, along with some other knives. But, you know, the, the dirty jobs, this is the one I grabbed. It came sharp. And it's still holding an edge. It's kind of shocking. I liked it so much. It's comfortable for $4, just like the tan flipper. I picked up another one, you know. Somebody asked for a knife. This is the first one that I'll give them. So... There you go. There's the four that I got for Christmas. Y'all let me know down in the comment section below which one of these y'all would like to see a review on first. And I would be glad to. Or if y'all don't want to see reviews on them at all, y'all let me know that as well. Hope everybody's having an absolute wonderful day. And like I said, bear with me. As soon as my daughter's feeling well, we're going to go through those questions. Pick out, pick out the winners to the giveaway and it'll come up soon. I hope everybody's having an absolute wonderful day, and I'll talk to you later. Peace.